Shout out to uh, is that K Max Spitz? Go subscribe to K Max Spitz. Look at this video in its entirety. Um, this is FTM Bay. She just went and did a live not too long ago speaking on the situation. I wanted to take a look at it and see what she had to say. So let's take a look. Crying. I cried in that video. If anybody could sit here and think that I would go all this as fucking hard to hear. I took him to the hospital October 3rd and I made the police report. Okay. Once I talked to my son and he came clean about David and we went over the story a billion million more times. I went through my phone. I got everything together. I got all that I could get together that I could bag up and I took my son to the hospital on October 3rd and I made the police report and I reported that David Salisbury. What she means she went through her phone and got everything together and got the bag up. After her son. What she mean? Got everything together. I got all that I could get together. Got the bag up. And I took my son to the hospital on October 3rd. And I made the police report. And I reported that David Salisbury sexually assaulted my child. Now as far as everything else in the police investigation, I don't have to talk about that and I'm not. Mm -hmm, okay. As far as why people are saying, why am I talking now? Like I said, when I first came on here, this is not the easiest thing to sit up online and talk about. Because at the end of the day, people are going to say that I'm lying. And it's hard to hear. But I'm not backing down from my son. And I never will. And, and I will forever be my son mouthpiece. And I owe that to my son. I owe for his voice to be heard. I owe him that. I had shit happen to me I ain't never speak on. Maybe a nigga thought I wasn't going to talk because cause I didn't handle my situations like that. But my son is a whole different ball. I'll, I will put my life on the line for my child. At the end of the day, I got to be smart. I got to move smart because I'm the only thing my child has. Okay, so... What did she expect to get accomplished from this other than creating a big hoopla like she did? If you took your son to the police, right, on and reported this on October 3rd, she said on October 3rd, and if allegedly he had screws wedged, or what she say, well, welt up his butt, God, I hope not, it would be proof there. And if the child is naming David, why wouldn't they go pick David up? Why would the police take all that information and then wait on David to show up? So are, is she saying David has a warrant? It's me. If I go to jail, I don't want to do something stupid like I wanted to. Who going to take care of my child? Well, he gonna have both his fam his parents in jail. Mm. And that shit happened to him. Who gonna take care of him? Who? I don't understand the strength that it took me to sit my ass in my house. To not speak on the internet. Because I couldn't jump any gun. I couldn't. Well, you were speaking on the internet. It was just about sucking dicks and stuff. You just weren't talking about this, and you were speaking about driving 120 in the Benz. I didn't jump any gun because it had to be done the right way. And the right way was y'all heard my son's voice. Y'all heard my son say it. Fuck me. Fuck me. Fuck him. Fuck what anybody got to say. I don't believe that was the right way. If your son already allegedly went through that trauma and already have to repeat himself to the police and tell this story... I wouldn't want my five-year-old reliving that. You already said you had him saying it a billion times. That's why in that last video, the baby was crying like, I don't want to say it no more. Damn. It's heartbreaking. At the end of the day, because he's painting the narrative, like I'm just, I don't know. Like I would do something crazy like this because we don't talk no more. It's just beyond me. But I posted my son. I 
put one of the hard, the the not the hardest thing I've ever gone through in my life. My son is in therapy. I'm not in therapy yet. I don't feel like it. I'll never have no reason to play. And it's just crazy that pe people, and people might actually come on the internet and cap about shit like that, but I'm somewhat of a public figure. Let me like, move it along I knew this was going to go bit. viral while. All that day, all that night. Oh, I'm going to call my Lord, my Lord for the mm -mm. I'm gonna call I shouldn't have skipped. Let me go back. Police wanted me to talk to him and try to get a confession out of him, and I didn't want to do it like that. But I had to go with my investigation. Oh, no. Wait, so, what did we miss? Go back. Okay, I ain't gonna see, move it no more. I went to the police station, and I set him up. Not set him up, but I had to do a control call where the police wanted me to talk to him and try to get a confession out of him. I mean, I didn't want to do it like that, but I had to go with my investigation. So, I talked to him. He knew about it. He asked me, well, what can I do? I wouldn't let Somebody touched her son. You just said you would go to jail or hell for your son, basically. The person who you saying did this to your son, the police said, I need you to get on a control call and try to make him confess to what he did. And you say, I won't do it like that. I won't do him like that. So I did my own investigation. Uh. Like, I'm going to put my name. I'm going to clear my name. I said, okay, come down to the police station and make a statement. I'm going to call my lawyer. Da, da, da. I said, okay. Call your lawyer. You can bring your lawyer to the police station. He called me all, all that day, all that night. Oh, I'm going to call my lawyer. My lawyer going to handle this. I'm going to go to the station. I'm, not even I'm going to go. I'm going to clear my name. Da, 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 whatever. So, okay. Cool. 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 Like, I, I'm telling you how you can clear your name. Go to the police station and make a statement. That's the only thing you can do to clear your name. You said that he did this to your son. How is it that simple that he can go to the police station and clear his name? What, he just going to walk in there and say, what he's saying on the internet? I didn't do that? And they say, okay, sir, just sign right here and you're free to go. I'm confused. What What is going on here? I ain't never seen a case handled like this. I mean, I haven't had one personally, but I'm just saying. Right? Never came to the police station. His lawyer never called me. Coincidentally, when I post this on Instagram, his lawyer was the first one to call me. So he was so quick to call that whoever she was. So do he got a warrant for his arrest? Or are they just gradually waiting on him to show up? When I post you on Instagram and, and her calling me to sue me for defamation of character, but she can't sue me for defamation of character when there is a case. Like, it doesn't, like, uh, whatever, that, I'm not even... <laughs> I'm finna try to look up this case, because I'm confused. If it's but a case, I should be able to see it on public record. And you come to your statement. Two weeks. So for two weeks, mind you guys, for two weeks, I'm finna get in and now. For two weeks, he knew. Right? I sent that audio to his brother, his sister. I sent it to somebody else um, who was supposedly close to Dirk. Um, which is this so you know the audio that she's talking about if you don't know look at the other video I upload uh, 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 Duty Law uploaded a video that she had sent to him previously already recording this child and she got frustrated because in the video that she's speaking of to me it sounded like the child said when she asked him what happened to you tell me from beginning to end the child started off saying, I heard like he heard somebody. He trying to repeat what he was being said. So it's like she abruptly kind of stopped it. So I wouldn't even mention that recording if I was her unless she talking about another one. And I wouldn't even send that out to nobody. Screenshot that he did post. I sent it to him. I sent it to when it, I sent it to his homeboy, Mike Yagi, and I sent it to him. Nobody said nothing. David was calling my phone after after I first told him he would call my phone every night. Every night he was calling my phone, texting me some bullshit. And I wasn't paying him no motherfucking mind. And I sent him the recording, no reply from nobody. If I was cloud chasing and doing all this and blah, 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 why you didn't handle this two weeks ago? Why you didn't handle 
why he didn't handle this two weeks ago. I'm gonna let her finish. This two weeks ago when I called you and I told you, my nigga, I know what's up. Why are you having so much conversation back and forth with someone who you believe harmed your baby? I don't understand. Why is he not blocked? And the only person he need to talk to is Jesus and the police and your attorney if you have one. This is weird to me. Two weeks ago, you could have came on the internet and said, man, this girl crazy shot, da 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 like, so if y'all here, you know what I'm saying? Because I know. Somebody... Who going to do that? Who going to blurt out this shit on the internet? Why would he blurt out this shit on the internet? To get this shit going. He he would want to not put this shit out on the internet. He don't want to address her right now. Somebody was lying on me. I'll get it handled immediately. I don't care if they can. I'm going to come first. Like, first of all, let me tell y'all what this, this crazy what this crazy bitch trying to do. He knew for two, two weeks. For two weeks. For two And you knew for damn near 30 days. weeks you you know you you knew you knew you knew I, i'm telling you i'm working police i'm telling everybody call my phone all his people i'm telling everybody what's going on i i'm telling everybody i sent him what he needed to see to get proof that it was a police investigation because he didn't believe me come to the station make a statement clear your name if you ain't got nothing to do with everybody, everybody had to make a statement we all had to make a statement everybody made a statement it's an investigation process everybody gotta make a statement so you was there you was there Right? Come make a statement. You ain't got nothing to hide. Come make a statement. You so oh 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 da da. da come make a, bring your lawyer. I understand if you want to have your lawyer. Come make a statement. Didn't make a statement. Didn't say shit. Nothing. Not. And it, it was crickets when I sent the audio. Crickets. So 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 so. so but but now I go to I go to the internet. So now everybody's like concerned. It's a whole different video. See, I think that he wasn't concerned. How my stuff clocking and I got it on pause? I wonder if it's such it. And it's almost done anyway. So that's the end right there for real because the video is to the end. I think that he wasn't concerned with the first video because the first, first video was bullshit. I think he looked at it and probably was like, in his mind, he done. She on some extra ass crazy shit. And to say nothing, leave it alone. Why go back and forth arguing with him? You know what I'm saying? Now, the next video that she uploaded on October 27th when she questioned that baby, that baby said his name. See, what she did was she corrected that first video. Because in that first video, she was in that video saying, you told me it was David. She was saying that to the baby. Now, in the next video, the baby is saying David's name. That's why I think they wasn't tripping. And I seriously do feel like if it was something major and the police truly believe that this man did something, ain't no waiting until he come visit them. They coming to knock on your door expeditiously. So we'll see what's happening. Uh, I feel sorry for the baby. That's who I feel sorry for. I really, really do. And I'm sending healing love to that child because, baby, to be in the middle of this stuff is heartbreaking. Love.